Danville on Christmas morning was the last place in time Abigail Halili and her siblings expected to have an encounter like this. And that guy just said he sells cocaine. We heard a guy parked in his car yelling from his window like, Keep walking, you need to get away from that store. The taunts quickly turned racial and included an obscene hand gesture. He just kept going on and on saying, you guys are Filipino idiots, you guys probably sell cocaine. Thanks to social media, the Halili family quickly learned they weren't the only Asian Americans in the East Bay to be targeted by these racist rants. San Ramon police tell me the suspect seen in Halili's video is the man they arrested Monday, linked to this racist and homophobic tirade at an In-N-Out burger in San Ramon on Christmas Eve. Are you guys filming yourself eating? Yeah. You're weird, I'm all <laughs> Irene Kim and her friend Elliot Ha were filming a video for TikTok when they too say a man approached them at random, pelting them with insults so vulgar they tried to laugh it off. In the moment, um, did not take it seriously, but afterwards it kind of started to hit me like, wow, this is serious. Like what happened in Danville, the hate speech quickly escalates. Japanese or Korean? Oh, I'm Korean. Yeah, you're Korean. Kim Jong Un's boyfriend, huh? After our story aired Christmas night, San Ramon police say they were inundated with tips from the public. That helped lead to the arrest of a Denver man with ties to the Bay Area. Both sets of victims realized the power of speaking out. Making it seem like not a big deal, I think a lot of Asian people in general do that. I want to bring more awareness to this, and I want, <clears throat> I want other people to realize, like, how how bad it is i just want people to learn that hate crimes against asian americans is a very real thing the individual who we are choosing not to name or show his face because he has not been charged was booked on two counts of hate crimes with more pending during a time when hate crimes toward asian americans has surged the halili family believes the swift arrest sends a strong message to the community it kind of makes me feel safe that like people are starting to like take these crimes seriously in San Ramon, Dion Lim, ABC7 News.